So the type of home ownership, renter or owner? Um, I live with my parents. Okay. Do they own or rent that? Uh, own. Okay. And the type of structure, single family, detached, uh, multi-unit? Single, single family. Okay. And the date they approximately moved in? I don't know, because it's since my mom was little, so I don't know. Ooh. <laughs> I know. How far back you think? This is just an approximate date, though. Okay. Then say, um, like, 1990. Okay. And then, have you always lived in Blakely? Yes. Tell me how your family ended up in Blakely. Um, we just always lived here. Is it a generation thing? Mm Mm-hmm. So, your your dad, your mom are Mm -hmm. all from here? Are both from Blakely. Your grandparents? From Blakely. Great-grands? Uh... From Blakely. Okay. At least, at, least my, <laughs> at least my mom's side of the family is from Blakely. Generations, at least. That's always awesome when you see some people got some generations here. That's a long time. <laughs> long time. But that's good, though. So, could you tell me a little bit about the um, about the house? So, the square footage, the bedrooms that you have. Um, is it brick, vinyl? It's vinyl. Okay. Um, it is three bedrooms. Mm-hmm. How many baths? Uh, two. Okay. And then square footage? I do not know. Okay. Um, is it brick? You said vinyl, right? Vinyl. Um, I'm sorry, rooftop. Uh. Is it the shingle one? The shingles. Or? Okay. And then have... You invested in solar either on the rooftop of the home, on your property, or as part of a business, or as part of a program through your utilities. Um, no. Okay, and then tell me uh, why you do not have rooftop solar. Did you make that decision, or was it made for you? Um, made for me. And why don't y'all have it? Um, I guess you could say because we were never asked about it. It's not something that's not very publicized around here. Mm-hmm. So it's kind of like nobody's coming to ask. So it's not something you're not really thinking about. Okay. And that makes sense. Um, and so if you had the option, though, and you could put a rooftop solar on your home, would you? Um, or if, not? It were, if it was affordable. Affordable? Okay. So yes, if affordable. Mm-hmm. Okay. Anything else? Um... They're very environmentally conscious, so okay. that would be another reason to get them if money allowed. Anything else besides the affordability, environmental conscious, and anything else that would make you want to get it? Um, I know that, like, eventually they will pay themselves back. Okay, so you want something that's cost-effective? Mm-hmm. Okay. Anything else? Um, that's it. Okay. So, now I would like for you to look at a map of the United States. Where is it at? Okay. And you have a pen. Mm -hmm. And so there, I would like for you to check where you think there are, uh, where people have installed rooftop panels on their homes so you can check whatever states you can check it off put a star color it however you like to to identify those states for me okay okay you got your states checked i think so all right let's let's just see real quick so we have california we have texas oklahoma alaska hawaii tennessee Mm mm-hmm and New York and Florida. Mm -hmm. Okay. And based on that, what makes that community so different from the people in Cochrane from getting that? Um, Why do you think those people have it more than, I guess, the ones here in the town? Probably, like, money. Money? economical. Okay. Anything Um, else? I would say probably population, I I believe. Mm -hmm. And like, kind of like what we were talking about, like cost effectiveness, especially like in Hawaii and Alaska. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, New York definitely has a bigger population. Mm -hmm. 
Um, California, same thing, more population. Texas, more popular of a population. Mm -hmm. Um, Also, like, if this makes sense, um, in some of the bigger states that I checked, Mm -hmm. uh, I guess, like, area, like, surface area. Mm-hmm. Like whether it's like you're talking about like on the rooftop or mm-hmm. like on the side of it. Oh, so you're saying like availability of where it can mm-hmm. be located? Okay, that makes sense. Not so much of a close unit as Cochran is. <laughs> <laughs> Anything else you'd like to think of that mm. maybe why some people have them? I check Florida because of like I think of sunlight. So I you're think- saying weather too? Mm-hmm. Okay. Weather, especially, uh, and more over here, uh, I was thinking about, like, we're talking about Cochrane, not Georgia as a whole. In mm-hmm. Georgia, I know the demographic is very different because, like, especially out with the mountains and stuff like that in the mm-hmm. northern part of it. Yeah, we're talking about Blakely compared to those. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, that's all I have to say about that. Okay. So, why do you think people here, the ones that you checked off, have the most solar on their rooftops? Um, that would be like what we said, like the availability of space, mm-hmm. um, cost effectiveness with like the economic value of it. Okay. Talking about there's like, especially like in the states that have more of a population. Mm hmm. So cost effectiveness and population. Mm -hmm. Anything else? That's it? Mm -hmm. Okay. So now we've done the United States. So I'd like for you to... Here's a map with the state of Georgia. And so I would like for you to check off where you think county-wise you have seen those rooftop panels where you think they might be. You don't have to actually see them where you think they might be. Okay. Mm-hmm. So you have checked off, let's see, San, what is that, that's next to Sandy Springs, Atlanta, that's a bit, Monroe, Bibb County, and I oh, got Houston, and Twigs, mm-hmm. And the next county next to it is Lawrence. Mm -hmm. Okay. So what makes them um, different from, or why do you think they have more solar rooftops than Blakely? Um, Especially in like uh, near Atlanta, Mm -hmm. when I checked off. Yeah. More, uh, I guess you could say there's more, there's a bigger population Mm -hmm. up there. And so, there's more people that are likely to use it and want to have cost effectiveness and save money. Okay. And I know that, like, certain buildings up in Atlanta do some use solar panels. Okay. And then, uh, why do you think the people in uh, these comparing to the Blakely ones... Is, is there any other reasons why you think they might have more than Blakely? Um, Anything know, else you want to think of? I know in Lawrence County, uh, like the high school in mm-hmm. Dublin has them. And okay. so that just makes me think that maybe some of the houses there would have them. Um, I know there's a bunch of uh, solar panel farms around that area. And so that's just a guess, an educated guess. Right. Mm-hmm. There's no right or wrong answers. Okay. So what about... Um, any of your friends in this in the state of Georgia, do they have solar on their roof? No. Why not? Um probably probably the same reason I would say. No nobody's ever asked them about it. Mm-hmm. They've never been approached about the subject of doing it. Okay. And do you think if there was, uh, like, information talked about it, do you think there'd be more out to doing it or... Yes, especially with uh, people knowing more about the situation and, like, the benefits of it. Mm -hmm. And um, that, like, eventually they do pay... I think what um, I read, it was, like, they paid themselves back in about 10 to 15 years. 
mm-hmm. solar panels on the rooftops. Okay. So you want to have some type of money incentive attached, possibly, you know, if you get them. Mm-hmm. Okay. Like that you'll be making a, like, cost-effective yeah. choice with buying them. Okay. And that makes plenty of sense. So anything else you'd like to add to it? Not that I know of. All right.